Hey, 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 everybody. Grateful Wednesday, grateful Wednesday, grateful Wednesday, grateful Wednesday. What are you thankful about? What are you thankful about? What can you give grace about? What are you appreciated about? Great. Grateful, grateful, grateful. Where and when do you take the time out for just a little bit of time to show the universe, to show the atmosphere that you are grateful? Take time out every single day. It can be from 5 to 15 minutes, you all. And share what it is. Just take time out in meditation and just speak it. What are you grateful about? If you're grateful about that you had enough money left in your bank account, that you was able to pay your expenses in your house for the, for the day, for the month, for the week, be grateful about that. Show appreciation when you pay it. Show that you don't mind paying it because you, you're paying it with gratefulness. You know, a lot of people say, oh, my God, it's the beginning of the month. I got to pay this goddamn rent, and I got to pay this goddamn light bill, and I got to pay my car payment. All you hear is complain, 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 complain. Why are you complaining when you know what you have to do, and you know that some of the stuff that you're doing, you're doing it because you chose to do it anyway. Didn't nobody put you in that car payment. So why not be grateful and gracious and happy to pay your expenses. When you change the way you think, you change the way you talk, you change your mindset. And when you change your mindset, you all, you actually change a shift in the atmosphere and it does something also on the inside of you, okay? Grateful is something that everybody says, oh, I'm grateful to this and I'm grateful that. I hear you talking, but when will you show your appreciation when when you show that you're grateful when will you show your family that you're grateful matter of fact when will you show yourself that you're grateful take time out to talk about the things that you are thankful for it could be on a daily basis but at least once a week you all you wake up every single morning you should be thankful to wake up and have another day on the land of the living because you could have been dead. Yesterday could have been your last day. That's a first start. I wake up. I get up every morning, you all. And the first thing I do, I, I immediately say, thank you. I'm grateful for a new day. I'm grateful for another day. Because once it's gone, it's gone. I can't repeat it. I can't get it back. You know, I make sure that I'm grateful for the food that's to eat, uh, uh, the money that's in the bank account. Um, if I see some money in my purse, you know, I'm just thankful. I'm just thankful for everything. When you start being positive, you start being happy. Um, and you all, it does a whole big difference. Even I was talking to someone earlier today. Watch what you say. They were saying that they was um, uh, trying to come home. I said, good morning, Marquis. Good morning, good morning, good morning, Mr. Carwell. How's everything going for you? Quit, be careful about trying to come home. He said, I'm trying to come home. I said, no, you're not trying to come home. You're coming home. You're preparing to come home. We all preparing for something. But how can you prepare for something bigger and better if you're not even grateful and thankful for the little bit of things that you got now? Are you working with what you already have right now? Are you working it to the best of your capacity? Are you working working with it in 100% capacity? Because if you're not working a little bit and you're not thankful, you're not grateful, you're not happy, you're not joyous... You're not on a positive vibration. You don't have positive energy with what you have now. How can you have that same energy for something bigger? Because if you get something bigger, that means you're going to have to have more positive speaking, more positive thinking, more positive energy, more positive vibration. 
and see about being grateful also you all grateful is also sharing your life grateful also mean being able to help someone else although you're going through a storm although you're going through the process but still you should be able to help others that's what we was designed and created for i share what i'm going through but i'm still grateful i share my emotions but i'm still grateful do I break down? Yes, I do. I have to unplug, recharge up, and come back and revamp myself up and get my vibe on and stuff. But you are what are you grateful for? So take time out. Get you a journal. Get you a spa notebook. Take time out. At least once a day, you all. Three sentences. Three. I ain't telling you to write a whole page or anything. Three. Become, make it a habit. Write down what you're grateful for. Three complete sentences. Three. And if you got more to say, write more. That is called a gratitude journal, a grateful journal. You can call it a thankful journal. You can call it whatever you want to call it. But start somewhere and start now being grateful in your life. Once you start being grateful, once you start showing appreciation, once you start putting things in alignment in place and giving the props where the props is due because you got to respect the laws you got to respect the principles once you respect the universe and of course if you god is the head and you put god as the head because all these principles and laws you all are following in the guideline of the bible whether you like it or not and once you put everything in perspective and you follow it and you respect it you all everything will fall into play but if you got just one little bit of negativity one little bit it, it just it runs everything else away. You want more, but you can't even be grateful for what the little bit you got. So how are you going to get more? So grateful Wednesday, grateful Wednesday. I'm not going to be on here long. Um, I just wanted to share that with you all. I think that there's not enough grace out here. I think there's not enough uh, thankfulness out here. Yes, we're learning our personal development. Yes, we're learning our meditation. Yes, we're learning our affirmation. But you all, you all, you all, it is time to get more thankfulness, more gratefulness into your life. Change in the way you think. Change the way you speak. As soon as it come here, change it, you all. Start writing it down because remember... Write the vision, make it plain. The more you write, the more you write, the more you write, the more you write, the more your eyes, your conscious perceive it and take it in. And the more that after your conscious take it to you all, it'll start doing a dump to your subconscious and you will start seeing a shift in the atmosphere you actually start feeling it it's almost like it's running through your blood veins as the old people would say you actually can feel it and once you start living life and you change the shift in the atmosphere it, 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 it you actually get to see the day start looking a little bit brighter where everything looked at like a yellow it becomes a bright yellow a green becomes a bright green you actually get to see things in a different portal you get to see it from a different perspective and that will let you know that a shift has taken place in your life and remember grateful and at grateful gracious thankful is not for the other people around you it's for you and once you have it everybody else will receive it from you because it will radiate off of you until the next one you all y'all have a good one catch up with you all soon have a good one